Hey everybody and thank you so much for joining me today here on Blind Whiskey Reviews, the most honest reviews on YouTube. So I've been building up the last couple of weeks, you guys have been seeing me put out all the reviews of the whiskeys that were going to be featured in this Distillery Wars Workhorse Whiskey Shootout, and we're finally here. So obviously I've unveiled the eight whiskeys and the eight distilleries we're representing in this shootout, and now it's time to get to the shootout itself. So before we get into it, I just wanted to make a quick video and give you guys an explanation of how this shootout has been set up for me, so that way you don't kind of get confused along the way. And I will be referring back to this video in most of all the shootout videos, so that way anyone that's just picking up one of those videos and hasn't maybe seen the rest of them, we'll get a feel for coming back here and figuring out what's going on. So I'm doing the shootout entirely blind. It'll be a head-to-head -head double elimination bracket, which means that each whiskey will get at least two opportunities to compete against another whiskey to become the best distillery out of the ones we have represented. So that's going to be a lot of fun. It's giving these whiskeys every opportunity to, to rise to the top and show that they're the best. So we should really get a good feel for which of these whiskeys, at least according to my palate, is the best whiskey among the eight distilleries here. So really excited about that. As for the shootout itself and how it's set up, my wife is running the entire bracket, which means I will have no clue where I'm at the entire time in terms of which whiskeys I'm taking, which round we're in. Um, I mean, obviously up front, I'll have some idea which round we're in, but that'll get a little bit more convoluted as we get to the winners and losers brackets. Um, and also, I will never know which whiskey I'm tasting, and the, the numbers that represent each whiskey will be changed each time we see that whiskey. So if Buffalo Trace is listed as whiskey number one in the first round, it'll likely be another number in the second time we see it. So that way, I'll never know which whiskey I'm tasting, I'll never know which ones are going head to head, which ones have lost, which ones have won. At no point in this during this shootout will I know any of it. And I'm gonna shoot the entire shootout before I ever unveil any of these whiskeys to myself and who's won what. So by the time you see this, the shootout's been complete, but it's just beginning for you guys. So hopefully you're excited. Hopefully you're gonna enjoy. Like I said, for me, this thing's gonna be entirely blind. I will put the whiskeys on the screen as I'm doing these shootouts, so that way you can see what the whiskeys are going head to head. I just won't know at the time. So it's gonna be a lot of fun. Again, I hope you're excited. It's been a long build up to this, so I'm glad you guys have stuck around till now, and hopefully we have a great time. So we'll see you in the shootout, which will be coming out in the next couple hours. Cheers.